Hey guys, Andy Black here and in this video I'm going to show you how you can take an existing article or blog post and improve it for SEO so that it ranks higher in Google. So I'm inside uh, my rewrite app dashboard here and what I'm going to do here is click on optimize an article for a keyword. Now what I'm going to do here is I'm going to create a new campaign. So the keyword that I'm going to target is going to be um, health benefits of dark chocolate okay I'll make sure I spelled that right and then all I'm gonna do here is click create an SEO keyword campaign now what is gonna happen now is it's in a queue and it's gonna be processed and the software is gonna go out and get all of the semantic data that it needs um, for me to optimize my article so I'm just gonna click pause just for um, a few seconds or a minute and we'll come back to it okay so the software has now retrieved that data as we'll see now in this list when I've refreshed the screen, it doesn't say in queue anymore. And here's the uh, campaign here. So I'm going to select that health benefits of dark chocolate. I'm going to click on optimize your article. And you will see that it's got 200 LSI keywords within the list here. Now, uh, again, the ones in green here, are these are the core keywords, the most important ones. Then we have a secondary set of important keywords. And these are uh, the ones that you can see in blue here. Okay, and then we've got a ton of other keywords that are all LSI words, all highly relevant to the um, target keyword um, health benefits of dark chocolate. So what you would do then is you would get your existing article um, or blog post. So um, you can obviously type a new article in or paste a new article and optimize it so that it ranks higher for your keyword. Or you can get an existing article or an existing blog post, post the content in here, and then improve it. And when you improve it using this data, you will get a higher ranking in Google and the other search engine. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to paste this article in. Now, this article isn't necessarily fully targeting um, the keyword health benefits of dark chocolate. But the, the title of this article is chocolate in a, in a dark form is a lot better than any other colors. So what I'm going to do here, I've pasted it in. I'm going to click calculate SEO score. And you can see here um, that the SEO score is actually quite high. So it is um, actually quite on point with it. And again, you can see here in the article, it's got things like the benefits of antioxidants, etc., etc. So it is very on point. So we've got an SEO score of 94% and an LSI spread score of 71%. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to pause the video and I'm literally just going to go through the article very quickly. And I'm going to basically uh, add some words in that we haven't yet used from this LSI uh, data list and also just increase some of the density. Now, if you look on the left-hand side here, this is like a proximity map. So this shows you um, all of my content, all of the article here, and you can see the scattering of LSI words. So you can see the green ones here, these are the most important ones, followed by the blue. You can see there's plenty of blue uh, LSI words throughout the content. Um, then there's orange, which is um, after the blue, and then any ones that are just black, which is just bolded, they're the kind of, um, the final LSI words. These are the ones that are less important, but still important nonetheless. So what I'm gonna do here is just pause the video, and although this is a good SEO score uh, for ranking for this keyword, I'm gonna just see if I can um, take it up a, a notch. Right, I have now finished this. So what, all I've done is basically gone through um, this part of the list here and got some of these keywords, one or two that wasn't being used. Um, like flavanols, for example, um, there was a relevant part of the article that I could put that into, um, and also just increase some of them that had a lower density, and this basically increased the LSI spread score up to 74%, as you can see now, the SEO score is 100%, so I've got it at a stronger level, so if I had these two articles, then the edited article that I've just improved would rank higher than the original version. So again, you can do this with previous uh, or existing blog posts. If you've got blog posts that are, are ranking, but they're not quite ranking as well as um, what you'd like, or they're not bringing in the sort of traffic or the visitors that, that you're wanting them to, you can simply just get the article, uh, the content from that blog post, put it in here, uh, um, obviously create your campaign for your keyword and improve the strength and the SEO of that article. And then basically, copy to clipboard once you are done and basically paste it back into your blog post. So I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Again, this is just one of the features of Rewrite Wrap. The software will also 
um, help you manually rewrite articles uh, sentence by sentence um, using a manual rewriting platform and it will also do the uh, rewriting and paraphrasing for you automatically with a single click as well there's also a new uh, additional feature that I've added to rewrite app that allows you to automatically rewrite an article but sentence by sentence so you can simply click on a sentence just once uh, or as many times as you like and it will instantly rewrite the sentence for you until you're happy with it if you don't like to do the typing yourself so um, again this is rewriter app you can get this feature plus all the others by clicking the link um, in the description or the button below this video and I hope to see you on the inside thanks for watching